Springhead Clan winning 4-3 tonight against Coventry Blaze to make the semi-finals of the Challenge Cup. Man of the match was the, the netminder here, Darren McChesney. Darren, well done, a, a great victory for the team tonight. Yeah, it was huge, uh, you know, come, to come from behind uh, that late in the game, uh, let alone to tie and then to score the winner with less than a minute to go is a uh, huge momentum builder for us and uh, we're just going to keep the ball rolling. Those first couple of minutes though, from my point of view watching it, first goal goes in, you're just about shoot that off and then next thing a second one goes in, what, what happened then? Uh, I think we were just kind of a little lackadaisical with, uh, you know, we thought we could just show up and win hockey and maybe not do the right things that we have been doing. And, uh, you know, credit to the guys who just kind of stuck with it and uh, didn't let that affect us and just kept the ball rolling. And, and uh, that's mental toughness right there when you don't let that affect you and you just keep working. You kept busy during the first period, Coventry. It's fair to say had a lot of chances on you. They had a lot of chances on you in the third period as well, especially when Clan were taking some penalties. Yeah. And going through your head, I mean, does it just feel as though, is, is it ever going to end, the amount of pressure that it, they've got uh, and the amount of chances? Yeah, I mean, you just... Uh, down, especially in the third period, obviously you're down one goal, and um, when they have that, that's, that's kind of the TSN turning point. If, if they score in that power play, it's, the game's over. So you know that you gotta you gotta make a save here, or there, and, and keep your team in it so they can you know score. Um, that's your job as a goalie to, to keep your team in it, and give them a chance to win. And um, if you can do that, then you know that's success. Well, I think it's fair to say you've had an eventful first few weeks at this club. You, you'd no sooner arrived than player coach John Kristanovic had left. Mm -hmm. Paul Gardner's come in as well. What have you made of that first three or four weeks here? Yeah, it's been good. I mean, uh, the first couple games, I, you know, I uh, I don't want to make an excuse, but I, I can say that uh, I was just want to get my feet underneath me and sure. and uh, didn't have the success that I would have liked to. Um, but you know, I think uh, the first win with this team was huge, and I think that's kind of started something here. And, um, we actually believe we can win every game now, so um, that's dangerous when you have a team that actually you know, believes they can win every game and uh, we're just going to try to keep this thing going. Paul Gardner seems like a kind of guy, he's quite an infectious guy, I'd imagine he'd be like that in the locker room as well, especially when he's trying to motivate you, trying mm -hmm. to get you going ahead of a game, is that a, is that a fair comment? Yeah, no, he, he's, uh, he's good, he's been around, he's experienced, so uh, that alone, you guys, guys listen, right? So when you have somebody that speaks up and uh, Guys respect him and listen to him. Uh, that's huge as your leader. You get into another big game on Saturday against Sheffield. You've had big results tonight, obviously. The big result in Belfast last mm -hmm. Friday, not to mention the Dundee game in between. Do the games get more important the more the season goes on? Oh, obviously, late in the year, the, you know, obviously we probably only have less than 20 games left, so every game is more important and you want to get as many points as you can. But, um, you know, we just got to prepare that uh, it's going to be another tough game and they're a good team and uh, we're going to have to a little bit of payback because last time we played them they, they smoked us so it'll be interesting. Good stuff. Well thanks for joining us Dan. All the best. Thank you. Thanks for watching.